All right, so what is the next thing we fight? <laughs> oh, that's actually an interesting, uh, that's an interesting map. <laughs> sure, why not? What the hell? <laughs> okay, um... <laughs> How the hell am I gonna get in here? <laughs> um... <laughs> <laughs> Start on the Timmy Island. You mean this one? <laughs> okay. Well, actually, like all things considered, this might be pretty easy. Okay. Here's the thing. This map is going to bug me. That is definitely a map. It really is. Shall we, uh... Solve my problems and also make this, like, 11,000 times harder? Probably a mistake. I hope there aren't cloud launchers. Uh, there's not actually. And we got, we got a little while before this becomes a problem. Let's go over here. A lot of blob nests. A lot of other things. But yeah, if I can if I can start taking this mine. Then we can actually get enough juice to keep this whole thing funded. And probably get just enough, yes. Because if I can get the factory, then we can get missile defenses if I can get over here we can get our hands on some snipers. I'm I'm shooting myself in the foot by doing this, but like not by too much. Okay. But we are going to have our work cut out for us with the blobs. Wait, the map seed is my wife. <laughs> She's not home at the moment, so I said, sure, why not? <laughs> oh. Okay, good. They didn't blow up anything terribly important. There we go. But we are going to need at least a couple more. Ooh, that's a problem. That's going to cause some damage. <laughs> okay, let's try that again. I needed a couple of guns. They managed to sneak some eggs in in places that I was not uh, quite capable of dealing with. It's fine. Okay. So, instead of doing the other, uh, what I did last time, I'm actually going to uplift. Because this will be much faster. Because, yeah, I was trying to raise and lower some stuff. When I really didn't need to. Okay, terraform. Uh, big brush. Copy this. Blah. Okay, there we go. So 
then, once again, but possibly more. That should be enough. The trees are going to give me some extra uh, juice. I think I can move this sucker. So once we have a little bit more land space, I'm going to get it out of the way. What was that about not terraforming when needed? Well, so this is necessary. It needs to be flat. It's just the question of how do I go about achieving this flatness? And then also having sufficient snipers to cover myself properly here. Okay, so we already have the red on. So we're gonna want a factory. Oh. I'll probably have to destroy those. And probably that too. Okay. How long do I got? Two minutes. Well, it feels better at the very least. Oops. Not you. No. Bad. This gun is currently in the way of the perfect grid. Uh, 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 there we go. Well, I guess it's not the perfect grid. I've already kind of screwed that over. But it's fine. Fine enough. get those down. This is going to give me enough. Do we have enough for the factory? Yes. And we have enough space for it. I'll put those down. I'll have to move them. According to everything, but that's fine. Question is, do we terp up more? More terp! I've got the funding. Okay, so let's get some missile launchers. And a couple more snipers. Should give me enough juice. Hope they build fast enough. 30 seconds. Yeah, I think we'll be fine. Uh, let's see. We might actually want one more, one more missile launcher out here. Now that I'm thinking about it. Okay, so let's speed this up. We've got our defenses down way faster this time around. Uh, there's, there's the damage flying my direction. But yeah, we didn't have to worry about those. And that's in the low land. I don't think we have to worry about it. I'm actually going to switch these to blue light. We're going to get a casual sprayer back here. Should give me enough, but if it if we don't have enough, ooh. We might want some more cannons along this edge for the time being.
Okay, we haven't lost too much. Just a sniper and a cannon. Losing the sniper is a little, little rougher. But it's fine. Okay, set that up. Perfect. I'm just gonna have an amount of this be blue eye. Two more sprayers. And I'm gonna need some more guns. At least we got the anti creep to kind of cope. Damn. Okay. Fine. Fine. I'll stop messing around. Let's see. So for like maybe right here. We should flatten that out. Only two terps this time. I'm not gonna worry about it. I uh yeah. I shouldn't I shouldn't be actually goofing this much. This is not an easy map. I've just been lured into a sense of Partial false confidence, uh, mostly owing to the fact that I, I've been preezing through maybe too much of this game, but that's fine. Okay, so we want to do Earn Portal first and foremost, and the Factory. We can just jam both of them in. Who cares about the flatness? We ain't doing we ain't doing that this time. Flat is not justice. Give me some give me some bumps. Okay. Next order of business. How do we, how the? How the devil do I line this one up? Yeah, that'll do. Let's move these over. We got what we came for and kind of, in that, hook these up. All right. Probably want to disconnect this. Just because this is actually in the way. Okay, this might have been my... This is a mis mistake? No, it wasn't a mistake. We got plenty of power. Give me the mines. Let's go wild here. Okay, so next order of business. We've got what we need. So we need, we need some missile launchers. One kind of in every quadrant. And then we need a lot of snipers. Including at least... A handful of rage snipers. They are very well prepared. And I should take that quite seriously. The grid is dead. Long live the grid. Okay. Power's looking good. Everything's kind of fine. We're also going to want... 
Cannons along the edge, as this is going to creep in in the worst possible places. And then a couple of mortars. Well, this area is not particularly important. Still want it. Why? Why am I incapable of selecting this sniper? I have no idea. Okay, so my power is looking pretty good, which is why we're going to switch all of these to blue eye right now. And we're just going to get a couple of sprayers. I don't think we have enough to sustain. But we have at least enough for a moment. as it can get. There we go. So now we've got at least some level of anti-creep flooding. Because if I kind of hold that, oh gosh. This is going to be a, uh, a problem? They're flooding space. I know they can do that. But it still feels like cheating to me. Okay, so next order of business, we are going to need a refinery. I guess we're going to need two. Two refineries lets me start getting some platforms down. Wow! I am glad I didn't even attempt to set up over here. This area is messy. <laughs> Curious, is Shell rooting for you or the wife? Uh, well, she's not here. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay. So we're going to need some uh, secondary platforms in space just to get around some of the line of sight issues. And then... to kind of guard against certain things. It should give me enough, yeah? This might actually get encroached on. I might not be able to do anything about that. We'll see. Because <sighs> yeah, the one issue is we're pretty capped out on power for a while. Yep, there it goes. Okay, so in that case, I think we're going to have to start here. Let's see, wonder would you ever do a Gwent Throne Breaker playthrough? I tried, back when it launched. It uh, was actually one of my worst series at the time, so I stopped, unfortunately. I don't really do a whole lot of playthroughs, either. This is, this is a rarity, to be honest. Okay, let's, let's try another one of these. I'm just gonna scoot it closer. I don't think it's gonna be able to get close enough with these towers defending it. Problem is I need maybe more mortars here. Just to keep them off of this. Because my goal, to some degree, is to take some space platforms. Wonder is a certified creeper world addict. It is a problem? 
it is a actual problem. Alright, but now that we've got these guns, hopefully, I, I just want to kind of have a couple of thi these things here because I know we're going to have some flooded space issues and I, I literally don't have enough landmass to defend against it properly. Okay, that should work a bit better. Alright. Well, I said I like this kind of map, and I was not kidding. But, hooey, this is going to be, uh... It's gonna be some real spice getting in here. So what is today's seed? My wife. <laughs> oh my god, look at all these eggs that are just adrift in space. They don't know what to do with themselves. And it's so deep. I think uh I think this is actually going to be one of the maps. There's a lot of green R2. Uh this is probably gonna be one of the maps where we need to um probably actually cheese grab some of this green R. Uh, we get a sweeper to get in because, like, it's ramping up really fast. I'm just gonna load up on a bunch of extra stuff. I just I just want to get in here because this is this is a major weak point. Yep, there's a rain cloud generator. I don't know where it is in this mix. Oh, it's right in the back. Air sac cauldron, got it. All right, well, time to turn this into a slight sh slideshow. Okay, go back here. I'm gonna have one of these. Specifically with it. Oh, hey! These are done. Yeah, I don't have that much green R. So can't do too much here. That's good. This is exactly what I was kind of hoping for. <laughs> what you doing, man? Could you call me back later? I gotta fight my wife for a YouTube video. <laughs> Like I, I don't actually think she'll be particularly happy that I've done this. <laughs> but there's also a very real possibility she won't notice. Somebody's gonna tell her, I'm sure, and I'll have to... I don't even think I'm gonna have to really explain myself. I think she'll just be like, why? Why would you do this? But considering I've already fought myself, I don't know. It's not that outlandish. Okay. So let's get one more of these platforms right here. And then I'm probably not going to, um... I'm probably not going to worry about this any further. This area was just very vulnerable in a way that I didn't want to deal with. Do split sprayers on platforms flood the void? Yes, but also no. So the big issue with um putting a uh, any kind of sprayer in the void is the void empties uh, like the void actively depletes what's in it, and so while you could conceivably flood the void with anti creep, I don't actually think it would be worth it. Ah. Uh, 
Sweet Bessie, how the hell am I getting in here? I mean, I know. I know what the answer is. But I think the real answer is I'm going to need some platforms before I can pull that off. How many more do I have? Five. We should probably actually boost a number of these things. There. Now I'm only down to one, but that boosts everything, which is worth it. Okay, this area is looking pretty well defended. I don't think anything is going to be getting eggs in here. Uh, we'll leave that guy. And we're going to want a lot of these. Okay. Because, yeah, my, my goal for the most part is to load up on a bunch of platforms along the way here. Maybe scoot over to the point where I can actually get a pair of refineries. Because, unfortunately, I just don't see myself actually making any meaningful headway here. Like, I think there's literally just too much creep. Let's see. Could fight the YouTube algorithm. I can't remember. Didn't I do that already? going to go too far or is it going to stop? So I'd like to fill out both of these platforms. I probably should only build one at a time. But I've got enough green R for it. Let's scoot this sucker up. Okay. Oh, hey! Would you look at that? Even though it looked kind of insurmountable, we actually got enough mortars that we could take clear land. Big bonus points. There's actually uh, some mine... Uh, I could actually potentially do some mining up here. Okay, I should probably get a cannon. Some cannons down. Nah, it's gonna get destroyed, ain't it? Eh. I can do some damage, but like, holy smokes, it is holding. Uh, let's see. Let's get one more platform here. Just so I can squeeze some more guns in. And I think we're gonna need that sweeper. Uh, despite the fact that I've almost kind of cleaned, cleaned this area out, uh... That's with the participation of, like, an obscene number of these guns. Uh, let's see. Let me take a look at this. I'm gonna... release an urn on that one. I'm gonna give one of these mortars a triple. and then a couple more cannons. Because, yeah, I should be able to maybe feasibly start pushing into this. Er, not an urn wand. We want this to always be on. That's what it is. I'm pushing back, but... Gosh. Alright, it's time. Uh, let's see, do we get this bad boy here? Probably. It might run into some line of sight issues, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to do too much with it. 
I might just have to move it around, do some other things. Okay, so let's take a look. First things first. Gonna want some snipers along this edge. Because, yeah, those skimmers are going to mess mess my day up. Eh, they're just going to be a, a massive inconvenience. Uh, let's see. Let's move this sucker up. How long we got on this thing? It's halfway. I'm going to try and take this little branch. I'm not... I hold no illusions that it's not going to be incredibly hard fought to even get up in here. But maybe that's fine. Actually, why don't we do... Why don't we do the really slow thing? Actually, this is meaningless, isn't it? Two is gonna go. Whoa, whoa, dang, that sweeper man. <laughs> two million down to two hundred thousand. Actual decimation. Scoot these over. All right. So now that we have thoroughly neutered him, is that legal? Well, it's not campaign legal. So, question mark? What? Oh, goof. Some of that got up to 20. Oops. Okay, so now that we've done some serious damage, I think it is time for... I'd say another ice cream sandwich maneuver, but I'm not entirely sure. Okay. No matter what, we want to get an M-Rift up in here. Get another one over here. Okay, so now that we've now that we've pretty much buzz cut this entire thing and rendered it eh, considerably less functional. You know, it's still a major threat, especially if it managed if they ever manage to take out the beacon. Or not the beacon, the, uh, da, 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 sweeper. There we go. Full Rusty gets messed up. Then we're going to have problems. However, let's see, my anti-creep is going reasonably strong. I can scale it up a little bit further. We, we just want this whole area to be, uh... Kind of defended. Because if I don't have to worry about it, then this area is, is easy to work with. Next thing is... We're gonna want, like, three refineries up this entire section. Where is... where is you? Okay, and then lastly, I want to move this up. Because we got to get in here. In here. Unfortunately, this is kind of where our journey ends. At least in this section. It's a lot of dark space. Wait, is it where our journey ends? Or... Is this just where I figured out figure out some new new cheesy back entrance to work with? Yes.
I'm just gonna take this spore launcher without even getting close, uh, without actually like touching it. Because if I can sneak in here, that pretty much neuters this entire area's defensive potential. Here's the question. Yeah, that's pretty much as far as I'm gonna be able to go. Uh, this is gonna hurt my sweepers pretty bad. I think it's kind of fine. Whew. Okay. Yeah, the question is, if I put one of these here... Okay, good. I have just enough room for another. And then the last issue is going to be all of this junk. Because what I want to do is actually be able to scoot all the way over here. That's going to be hard, though. I might, I might actually just be best, best off by, um, being as aggressive as possible and just pushing forward. Uh, let's see, structures, miners. Did I never connect to this place? Oh, right, I connected it via that one singular linchpin spot. Which is, like, fine. Could be better. So, yeah, let's, uh, let's get in here and, and make some problems. Like I said last time, I am, um, hamstrung by my reliance on... anti-creep at this point. I don't think it's necessarily a bad thing, but it's, uh... It's making it a little hard to do any other strategies. Then again, these maps are, like, absolutely brutal. F for green our production. Yeah, I'll get out of there in a hot second. Well, that platform is scuffed, but I don't think I'm going to be able to do anything about it anyway. Uh, let's see, where's that rage gun? There's the rage gun. We're going to need it to keep this, this thing tame. Because if I can get this spore launcher... Uh, if I can get this spore launcher... Nullified? There. Then this area becomes very, very easy to deal with. Okay. Nope, not that. Yeah, okay, we've got at least one of those there. Okay, another nullifier. Take this area. Are you overloading? Yes. Okay, another nullifier. How close do I have to be? Pretty dang close. Let's do exactly that. I'm just gonna push in. Cause yeah, this is uh, some anti-creep duplicator. Now, honestly, actually, if we face punch this entire area, the whole whole place falls apart. There's not going to be anything left. Uh, let's see. Did I buy build miners on the blueite? I think I've built the miners on all of the blueite except for this section here, which is currently kind of uh, filled with other defenses. Okay, overload that set you to overload.
Get a couple of snipers up in here. Any of my snipers didn't have quite enough range. that a little closer. I actually have an amount of urns that I can just put into something. My rage gun. Or did my rage gun get messed up? It probably did. Or, no, it's literally right next to it. How did, How could I possibly have goofed that? Whatever. Okay, this nullifier, well, it's overextended a little bit. Should be fine. Scoot forward once again. Set everything up. Just get in here for some abuse. Oh, right. And I should probably get some missile launchers. I've kind of neglected that side of things. Yeah, so I could potentially get some more miners up in here. We probably should, actually. Yeah, let's just flatten this out. There we go. This is good. You are not overloading. But we've already we've already taken out like a solid a massive chunk of what they had left. So next order of business. Uh let's get a special. I'm gonna get an M Rift kind of here on the frontier. We're gonna have to figure out how the heck we're gonna get up to this. Because we've got an emitter, like, on a cliff. Ugh. Really high up there. I... I don't know. We'll figure it out. I'm probably just going to turp up to it, make a nice platform so I can just shoot it down, and then we'll work our way through it. Oh, that's kind of a funny strategy. I don't think I'm ever going to use it, but the idea of surrounding a stash in reasonably high walls kind of neuters it. Okay, that didn't work. Okay, get you off of that. So here's the question. Any of this hook up? Yes. Okay, so I could I could actually get a tower right there if I wanted to. I'm going to do one for now. And you're going to focus on mesh. Nope. I think I'm going to need both of them. So rude. Okay. Maybe put that one there. Because they tend to shoot whatever's closest to them. So if I actually have it ringed in a little bit, I think we'll be fine. 
And then the next one's going to be easy once I get this set up. Okay. Next order of business. Probably just kind of keep sneaking these in wherever I can. How's my green art production? Decent. Could be better. I'm going to move these forward. They're not doing anything. Okay, and then structures. We need refinery. Right, I cleared this whole area out so I could squeak in some more uh, mining machines. Oops. This is not going to be the most efficient mining setup you've ever seen. In fact, that's frankly kind of dismal, but whatever. Okay, and since I don't think I need any more energy, we're just going to make this whole thing blue-white. Honestly, now that I'm looking at it, what if... What if we just had all blue-white? It's my energy generation. Oh, it's fine. Give me that anti-creep. Let's go. Okay, so that, that causes some issues. It's my sniper. I had an aggro sniper right over here. Let's actually use it. Oh. Damn it. I look away for like two seconds to go deal with other things and they manage to wipe out most of my rage guns. And the nullifier. Gosh. Alright, whatever. There we go. It's nullified again, and this time I'm going to overload it, and we also have a sniper in the area that can actually hopefully take out some worms. Speaking of, let's just kind of spam this area full, as I don't want to deal with any more worms messing with my junk. That came out kind of weird. Whatever. Okay. And since my forward line of sprayers didn't work, we're going to do a back line here. There. That should guarantee it. Alright, do we have enough anti-creep? Yeah, actually, it looks like we've depleted it pretty heavily here. Yeah, works for me. Okay, question is, can I get a nullifier on the other side of this thing? Yes. I'm just going to get that set up so we don't have to worry about anything, because if I can take out that, uh, that nullifier, we don't have to worry about the anti-creep. Or not the anti-creep, the, um, the mesh messing me up. Now you guys. It could be more appropriately located. Put more of this stuff up. It was this was definitely a little bit more of a uh, just absolute slugging match. But honestly, it's not going that badly for me. What did we lose? Nullifier there? Oh, that's... That's not a problem. Let's get these bad boys here. Because yeah, this area... This area is almost nothing. Yeah, 
and is nullified. Yeah, it's easy. Okay, set overload. Next order of business, this guy. Who's luckily, I'm right inside a shield, so I don't need to worry about it. It's like it knew I was coming for it. You fool. Nothing you can do about it. There we go. That should be nice and nice and easy. Rude. Try that again. Those worms really like to just kind of show up and make everything stinky. Well, it's fine. I'm just going to point so many snipers here that they won't be able to get a word in edgewise. Ow. I think one of my mustache hairs got stuck pointed upwards into my nostril. That hurt. Okay, so what else are we looking at? Almost nothing. There's, what, one emitter left and then it's just kind of the small little goon builds? Technically, if I wanted to, I could actually just like... Oh no, there's, there's, there's two more emitters. How many more of these do we have? You know what? Actually, all things considered, die! It would certainly help if I actually had power towers to connect this whole thing. You know, as I'm supposed to do. But yeah, I'm not using really any of these guns anymore, to my knowledge. So, uh, yeah, let's just, uh, have a party. Go say hi. Okay, so we want you to focus mesh. Let's keep getting, let's keep getting up in this. Are we going to suffer extreme losses? Yep. Do I care? Nope. My goal was mostly to take this anti-creep and these two things really quickly. I think I've succeeded. Okay, while we're here, set up an M-Rift. Ooh, that was mean. Okay. MRF's almost done. Yeah, the worm just waltzed right over it. Absolutely rude. That's right, special. I don't normally truck with shields, but maybe today's a good day for it. No good spot for me to put that thing, but that's fine. Overload that. Okay, then all I have to do is just get in here. Uh, let's see, is there anything else I could do? I mean, I guess yes. I don't think we need the sweeper anymore. I'm actually just gonna turn it off. What got destroyed? Oh, that. Rude? How would he do that? There's like nothing there, but just to spite him, I'm gonna do that. Alright. So, it looks like we can get more rockets, if I wanted to. I just need to find enough land for it.
probably too little, too late, doesn't matter, shouldn't have bothered, but... Eh. Okay, I'm just gonna hook up a bunch of these things. Get rid of these eggs because we kind of want to take this area here so that my anti creep can start flowing down the corners. There you go, that should be fine. Okay, and then the worms are gonna mess me up. So I'm just gonna have like a stupid amount of snipers right here. That should pretty much prevent all possibility that they're going to do major damage. They'll still do still do some, but not nearly enough. Yeah, the skimmers are rude. Another one of these here. Because, yeah, if I can nullify all of these. You know what? Screwed. You can't stop them all. There we go. Alright. And then all that's left is the, uh, the air sac cauldron. And one kind of really sad looking... Uh, emitter that is already starting to get flooded. Alright, how long was this one? I think... Oh, I just didn't cycle my recording. So yeah, actually shorter. I was kind of worried that this one was going to be a, uh, a doozy of a fight. Considering the first couple of false starts, but uh, once I got going, this was not bad at all. Uh, let's see, anything else? No. I think we're clear. Gonna put that there. Amusingly enough, there's just a little bit of anti-creep generating from that one wall segment that's gonna be kind of hard to generate. Did he get me with a rain cloud? I don't know. I got him bad. I got him worse. And now is any of this gonna leak down? I don't think so. It doesn't really matter. I don't wanna... I won't get rid of all of the creep. That just sounds like effort. <laughs> don't... <laughs> Let's not think too much about this seed. <laughs> I mean, we could, but nah. That was fun, though. I'll play more of this probably sometime next week.